hello guys today's session we want to see how to add uh, a top bar section and on the top bar we will also try to have uh, social media on the on the top bar so let's see how we can do this so on the top bar we want to be able to have like maybe like a, a text then on the on the right side we can have a social media social media links like this one so this is the header section so the top bar will be above the header section so let's jump in right away so we'll be using we'll be working on the customizer to work on the top bar nothing else so let's go to customize you can find customize on the appearance customize the same thing so on the customize uh, I'm using Ocean WP theme. Other themes, other themes might differ, but they might not be different. So for Ocean WP, you come to top bar. On the top bar, you click general. On clicking general, you must enable top bar. You must enable top bar. So you wait for it to refle refresh for like two seconds. Now after enabling tool top bar. You can see now you can be able to see the top bar. On the top bar we have like a, a phone number. Yes, then there's nothing else. So on the phone number then the text is, the background is dark. You can see the background is black. I mean dark. Text color is white. So for the border, border is uh, brown. Link, link color will be dark. So we can't have a dark background and links to be dark. So we'll also put link color to be white. So white. Link over. It can be yeah, light blue, not bad. So I will publish this because I've made changes to this. So now by enabling top bar, you can be able to see it. You can bring it to live. And, and now we can continue. So I, I can go back to general now. Initially, I had only general, but now I have three sections. I have general now, which I already had. Then I have content. Then I also have the social. So I'm interested in social. So it takes some, me some seconds to load this social tab. But what we can do is refresh here. So it has refreshed. So I go back to top bar. No, top bar. Top bar. Social. Now you can see now, social is also enabled. Now, since it is enabled here, I can scroll down. You can see even the social link target. When people click, it will open on a new tab. If you want it to open on the same tab, you can do this. Same window, meaning that People will not leave your website to go to this social media. It will just open inside that tab and they can just click back to go back to your website. But now if it opens on a new window, it means they can't click the back arrow to go back to your tab because they are on a different tab. Now social media links color. Mm, so I think I can work with white because I have a dark background, white. Then on hover, we can go with the light blue we had. Light blue. Okay. I think that's fair. Now on the links here, you can see I can have Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. So in, it is like this by default. So you can remove this hashtag to put a live link. If you already have a... If you already have a, a live page but if you don't have it you can just write twitter.com slash hashtag so that it will load the twitter platform but it will not load anything else it will just load the home page of the twitter even when you put this it will also load the home page of the facebook same way with instagram but now if you have like a real instagram page you just go to Instagram, 
copy the link of your profile or if you know the short the name you can just write instagram.com slash the name you are using on instagram the username and ensure your links do not have a space links do not have a space if you put a space it will be treated as a, a different thing apart from a link so uh, i think linkedin.com then i click publish you can see now they have started appearing the social media so what i can do it i can exit this customize so that now you can preview it lively on our website so now you can see on one side we have the phone number we have the social media on the other side we can link all of these as you can see i have linked it to twitter so let me click twitter you will see it is opening on the same tab and it is loading the home page of twitter now i can go back because i chose the the default target to be same window meaning that it is not opening on a new window now let's see what where this number is and how we can change it so we head back to customizer top bar on the top bar we have content now this phone number is content so you go to this section of content you will be able to see the phone number there for the email we can also have an email we can separate it using this stick so email i can say can say i can call it local at localhost so if you have an email you come and type it here so this is just random just writing random here if you have a gmail if you have a business email you just come and write it here and you also if you need to link it now this will be advanced you'll have to write a, a code so that when people place the mouse on it it will show a link and when they click it they can be taken to maybe send email or maybe call your number so we can see this later so for now this is the content you can go ahead and add maybe if it is another location be new york yeah so you can do that so i can publish and i and now you see our top bar is looking very good given that we have matched the background color with the text color it is very visible to the eyes you don't even struggle to see it so that is how you can create a top bar and add social media icons to the top bar very easy very clear so thank you for watching to this end go ahead and subscribe and ensure you like our video check out also our other videos we post a lot on wordpress development so you should learn a lot on WordPress by watching our videos. So enjoy.